Have you guys ever been anxious and worried about your grade or test? Yes. I think most of you have. Sometimes, if you get worse grade than you expected, you might feel depression and despair. You might be more addicted to grades, such as asking teachers, is it grading, or how much this assignment worth. Um, instead of thinking of your own improvement, you are worrying about your grades. As one short example, imagine if you took a math test with a topic that you already know. And unfortunately, you got worse grade than what you expected. At this moment, are you going to simply retake again without looking mistakes and what you got wrong? I actually do that. From this point of view, we are taking, we are coming to school for test ourselves, not learning. We have to come to school for learning, not to worry or feel anxious and depressed about your grade or test. For the most part, our education system is overemphasizing our emphasizing testing while underemphasizing our actual learning. The interesting point is that people think this education system is effective with results, good grades, and achieving masteries in many subjects, which can be somewhat true, but mostly not. Currently, in many parts of the world, teachers are emphasizing the wrong instructional techniques and goals. According to the research, in the article, test preparation does not benefit students. Teachers are spending class time by practicing test-taking skills, uh, rehearsing test sample questions, and giving importance to the test. Also, students are memorizing for tests and grades. The point is whether students need basic skills or if there is a war of memorization or drill. They actually do, but the education system is not just simple basic skills and memorization. Students have to learn how to apply things they learn in mathematics to everyday problem. Students have to learn right, learn to be more observing, predicting, interpreting, and asking questions in science. Students have to be students have to how to write clearly, thoughtfully, and persistently when they write. Students have to learn how to be insightful and critical reader in reading. Students are simply not, without, not good test takers. What is usually measured when a test is given is, is the ability to children to sit down and be quiet and mark the correct place, not what they have learned. Uh, also, tests are not actually measures of students actual learning, development, and learning. Meanwhile, research shows that students should be focused upon tests and activities uh, that prepare students to be perform tests in, in the real world. The problem is that besides going to the students, we are actually creating a generation of young people with, without creativity and the ability to innovate to solve problems. We need to think back. Are we actually learning the information or memorizing stuff? We need some changes for our future next generation. A good grade does not mean they are actually good at it. Gyeong Eun and Juno said that once they, when they got bad grades, they actually try to raise their grades without looking what they need, what they got wrong, and what are their mistakes. As research, they actually did improve their grades but they didn't have any improvement of actual learning. Let me give another example. Uh, when I had the homonyms and the Ivanakya test, I memorized homonyms and part of speech, and I got good grades. However, now I can't remember them well because I have many things to learn and memorize after the test. I did how to test, I learned how to do tests by memorizing, memorizing, and memorizing. However, in future, it is hard to remember unless we learn it again. The big problem is if we took a test and we got good score, we think we are good at it and we don't look at it again. Also, learning should take, long, take a long time, not in one or two days of memorizing. And like, to master one topic, it has to spend a few days to understand it. We are going on wrong ways. 
Memorizing for tests is not the right way and good way to learn. You don't have to understand how this works, not memorizing important things. Some parents normally think this education system is effective in many ways. By the score, students can be competitive and, and it gives motivation. On the other hand, such creativity and thinking ability and actual learning is being nothing. Uh, with the more minimum competence, the less maximum achievement students get. With, in the United States, the NCLB, which is No Children Left Behind test, is giving scores by pass and fail. If pass is over 60%, students don't really work hard to get 100% unless if they give score by pass and fail. The grades can be also be pain and sadness to the students. Student. In the math test, which is measurement of academic progress test, if someone gets 206 as a score, however, you got 240. Many people think this score can give competitive and for better progress. However, learning should be competitive. competition. If students become competitive while learning, They don't learn much, because only thing they focus is to learn more and memorize more. Moreover, students can hurt, score can hurt and give bad feelings to students who work really hard. However, they got bad grade for some reasons. The modern education system needs change. The testing and grading is being meaningful in our lives. The testing and uh, what is sorry. Uh, the testing and grading is being meaningful and important in our lives, and that makes students being addicted into grades. What if testing and grading becomes less meaningful than now? What if the testing and grading becomes what it was supposed to be? What if the test teaches us what we missed and didn't become a decision for our future? As a student, we can't change, but if we grow up, can we change for our next generation? Overall, modern education system is harmful to students. This education sy this system is making students into puppets which can control themselves. Study and learning is a big part of our lives. Also, creativity and the ability to solve their own problem is important. What modern education system is destroying student creativity, thinking, and eager to learn new things and explore it. This is not too late to change. We need to start thinking about what, what our we need to start thinking about our wrong education system. Maybe if I take a math, if I take a math test. I can test a test to know about my understandings and without worrying about tests that can affect my future and parents. That seems like more effective than better education. Thank you.